The Georgetown Public Hospital has delivered a total of 606 babies in October. There were 136 cesareans. The facility is working to decrease maternal and neonatal deaths. However, head of the obstetrics and gynecology program, Dr. Lucio Pedro, pointed to the importance of having the cooperation of the regional hospitals. During the commissioning of the GPHC's new maternity unit today, Dr. Pedro stated that of the total deliveries, 82 were referrals from regional hospitals. He bemoaned the fact that most of the referrals were from the West Demerara Regional Hospital, which is plagued with numerous issues. There have been a lot of problems with this institution. I understand they close at 5 o'clock and after that, all patients come to Georgetown Hospital. The reasons cited are no blood, no consultant, sometimes the roof has caved in, or the hospital is just closed because it is night time and there is no on-call payment. Public Health Minister Valdo Lawrence, who was also at the event, used her time to respond to the issues and admitted that the hospital operates at a lesser capacity after 4 in the afternoon. She noted that this is because there is not sufficient laboratory technicians and other technical staff to work beyond that eight-hour period. We have been working with the region authorities and the Minister of Communities to ensure that we address that situation. And as I stand here, the work is being done. And before the end of this year, that hospital will be run on a 24-hour basis. The minister said works are ongoing to upgrade other primary health care facilities across the country to ease the strain on the Georgetown Hospital. Baby Katun, Newsroom.